Hey there, welcome to NoBS Tutorials. My name is Cubed, and I know why you're here, so let's skip the BS. This video will detail how to download and install any and every version of Optifine for Minecraft Java Edition. I'm not going to send you through any third-party sites to complete your download, nothing like that. We're just going to cut out the middleman and get Optifine installed in as few steps as possible. So, to begin, you're going to want to click on the first link in the description, Optifine.net, which is Optifine's official website, and then click on Downloads. This will, of course, bring us to the Downloads page, where you will see the most recent release of Optifine presented to you at the very top. If it is an older version you are looking for, simply click show all versions and you can take your pick. Once you've identified your target version, go ahead and click on the blue download button. Due to how Optifine's website is set up, this will almost definitely redirect you to an ad focus page or something of the sort. More often than not, these pages will have misleading advertisements attempting to trick you into download something you do not want on your computer, so in order to ensure your device's safety, do not click anything on this page except for the skip button once it appears. Once you've done that, you will be brought to this direct download page. Again, be cautious of misleading advertisements, the only button you should be clicking here is the blue download button directly below the version title to begin your download of Optifine. Once the download is complete, your browser will likely warn you about this file type, as in general .jar files can potentially harm your computer. But since we know where this file is coming from, we can safely select keep. We do now have the Optifine installer downloaded, but for most of you, you likely do not have the necessary Java files downloaded. For me, this is the case and I'm able to tell because when I go into my downloads folder and attempt to launch the jar file, the only thing I'm able to open it with is the Microsoft Store, which obviously is not going to work out for us. If you do already have the prerequisite files and were able to successfully launch the Optifine setup wizard, then go ahead and skip to the timestamp on screen, but for the rest of us, we're going to go ahead and click on the second link in the description, which will bring us to the Java download page. To download Java, first of course read the entire terms of service like a good internet user, and then click the agree and start free download button. Once again, that will begin a download in your browser, and upon its completion, go ahead and launch the exe file. File. This will bring up the Java Setup Wizard, and all you'll have to do is click Install. The installer will let you know when it is complete, and then you can close the window. With that out of the way, we can now head back to our Downloads folder and launch the Optifine jar file. It will automatically locate your Minecraft directory for you, and then you can just click Install. After a few moments, you will receive a small pop-up informing you that the download is complete. And that is all. If you now head into the Minecraft Launcher and expand your installation menu, you will see that Optifine has automatically made a new installation preset, which is exactly what we want to see. If for whatever reason this does not automatically appear for you, first, just try restarting your computer really quick, often a quick reboot will remedy whatever problems you may be running into, and then head into the installations tab of your Minecraft launcher at the top here, select new installation, press the version drop down menu, and you can select your Optifine version from the list. Obviously you can name this installation whatever you'd like, and then click create. And there you go. From now on, whenever you go to boot up Minecraft, just select your Optifine installation from the menu and jump right in. In any case, that's all I've got for you today, and I hope I've helped you out by making this video. If you found this video helpful, please consider dropping us a like, or sharing this video with a friend so they too can skip the BS. As always, if you're running into any issues during this process, leave a comment and I will do my best to help you out. Thanks for choosing NBST. I've been Dre Cubed, and I'll see you around.